Hello, it's Miles McGeehan here. This is a weekly update regarding new content within week four of the hybrid learning course. Once you log into Course Sites, navigate to Course Materials, and then choose week four. This week's focus is on designing rich content using attached files, embedded YouTube videos, and inserting live Google Docs. We will also demonstrate some advanced features of the gradebook regarding managing lots of assignments through the creation of grading periods. Finally, we will include a short tutorial regarding Blackboard Collaborate, which will be used for remote access to live help from your instructor during office hours. Let's get started. This week's tips will help instructors design robust LMS content, regardless whether the content is in the form of an assignment, item, discussion forum, blog, or a wiki. These tips will also likely work for other LMS platforms too. Please browse through this week's topics and explore all the possible links in instructional videos. Note that you can click on the YouTube video and expand it to a full screen using the YouTube icon in the bottom right corner. And also note that there are hyperlinked areas within the text, underlined in blue, that, that participants can click on and explore more. There's some good content here, so be sure to, to uh, look through it all. We aren't covering a lot of new topics this week so that participants have ample time to create an activity and compose a lesson plan which is due by the end of the week. This is for students seeking college credit. Those of you that are just attending for a CEUs should exhaust all of the content provided, but it's optional if you want to leave a lesson plan. Lesson plans should be composed in a word processor following the expectations covered in the course syllabus. Once you've composed the lesson plan in a word processor, simply copy and paste the lesson plan into the discussion forum titled Lesson Plan 1. One last thing. If you want, you can opt to log into live office hours using Course Sites Live between the hours of 4 p.m. and 5 p.m. Tuesday, April 2nd. Course Sites Live is a real-time collaboration tool to support teaching and learning. This virtual classroom includes chat, voice over IP, application sharing, and a whiteboard. Simply click on the Course Sites Live button on the left between 4 p.m. and 5 p.m. to join and ask questions to your instructor. This is completely optional. Blackboard's Collaborate is a tool oftentimes used by webinar hosts. Participants can turn on a webcam in the corner to project themselves. The teacher and students can share a whiteboard space to write on or to include text on or drawings on. And another button here, uh, application sharing, allows the instructor to share the view on the desktop with students so I can give you a tour of whatever I need to show, whether it's within course sites or on another website or in an application. Or the, the instructor can also mirror and see what's occurring on the student's side of the computer. All while a live discussion through the microphone is being held. This is a pretty neat tool and it's awesome that it's free through course sites. Hope you can find some use for this. It's great that this tool is free within course sites. It may be useful to, to work with a student that might be sick or out for a long time um, or a student that is on vacation and so forth. Well, that's it for this week. I uh, hope you enjoy the content as you browse through um, the week four folder. And uh, please, if you have any questions or need to meet one-on-one, uh, -on -one, just go ahead and email me at miles.mcgann at bsd7.org. Until next time, have a great week.